guys, I'm Ashita and welcome back to my channel. In this video, I'll be talking all about lingerie and what you should be wearing under what. So I get a lot of questions in comments on my videos asking me what am I wearing under an off-shoulder top or just like a bodycon dress and stuff like that. So I thought I'll answer all those queries uh, right here in this single video so you won't have to watch any other video apart from this. As usual, I'll try and make it as informative as possible so I hope you guys find it helpful. So let's get right into lingerie. 101. But before I start the video, don't forget to hit that like button, also that subscribe button and I also have an Instagram feed, I'll mention the handle somewhere on the screen so don't forget to follow me there as well. with t-shirt bras. This one is from Shy Away and uh, it has a really nice uh, peachish color and it's extremely seamless. Now my recommendation is whenever you buy a t-shirt bra make sure it's well fitting of course and the second thing is make sure it's seamless. There are a lot of bras that have like a lace lining and that tends to show through the top or the t-shirt that you wear which doesn't look that nice so I highly recommend that you pick up a seamless t-shirt bra. Of course you can pick this up in different colors but if you're wearing a top that is white or slightly transparent make sure you're wearing a nude bra with that. This one also has an underwire which gives an extra support and because these are super comfortable these are perfect for wearing on a regular basis. The second bra that I want to talk about are strapless bras. I have a nude and a black strapless bra. Honestly I can literally live my entire life just wearing nudes and black bras because they are literally the best that you can wear under an outfit. These are trust me the go-to lingerie that you really need in your wardrobe. This also has an underwire and I personally prefer wearing bras with an underwire because it gives that extra support. And make sure you get the right size when you're buying a strapless bra because that can really make or break uh, how it fits you. In my experience, I always go a size smaller when I'm buying strapless one because I feel they tend to fit better and not slip off, you know, during the day that you're wearing it. And these are perfect for wearing off-shoulder tops, cold shoulder tops or sleeveless or even just spaghetti or camisole tops. So get yourself a black and a nude bra which can also be worn as a strapless bra. The next category of bras would be a plunging neckline. Now these are perfect for when you have a dress or an outfit that has a deep plunging neckline. If you see the regular t-shirt bras, the middle bit is slightly longer compared to this is like tinier which is why uh, you can avoid the middle part showing if you're wearing something that has a deep uh, neckline. So yeah, you should definitely have a plunging neckline in your bra collection as well. The next bra that I'll be talking about are actually bralettes and these are super comfortable. They come with cups which are uh, removable as well. This one is again from Shy Away and uh, these actually can be worn with halter neck outfits as well uh, because some of the bralettes actually have a funky back which looks really cool. You can throw these on with uh, just a denim jacket or wear it under a shirt or if you're confident enough to just wear this as a top, I mean that looks great as well. You don't have to worry about the underwire and the push-ups and all of that so these are really comfortable and uh, you should definitely have one in your closet. For backless outfits, you can opt for stick-on silicone cups, although they don't really give you very good support. That's why they are better for really tight-fitting tops or outfits when you wear them. And you also get these nipple tapes, but I really don't find them useful at all because they don't give me any support. Obviously, these are better for someone who's not heavy-chested, but uh, you know, if this works for you, then definitely go for these. Apart from these, you also get transparent strap bras, so the back has like a transparent strap instead of usual hooks at the back, which I personally don't prefer because I feel it just spoils the outfit with that uh, transparent plasticky look. However, I have a tip that whenever I buy something backless, I get it padded directly by my tailor. So to avoid that whole hassle of wearing strapless bras and silicone cups that you know don't really stick on all the time. So if that is something that might work for you, you can definitely try that out. Now moving on to sports bras, these are actually really comfortable and they come in different categories. You have like low impact and then high impact, medium impact and stuff like that. So that depends on the padding and the kind of support that bra gives you. Please do not ever go to the gym wearing a regular bra. Always wear a sports bra that um, you know you're comfortable in because it can really be harmful. And yeah, pick a one that suits you. I'll mention a few links in the description box so you can check them out as well. So those are most of the bras that I wanted to talk about and that I 
personally wear with all of my outfits. Apart from that, there are bras that are push-up bras. There are different kinds of push-ups and different levels of push-up. Push-up bras basically have extra padding that gives you an extra lift and uh, a little more support. Then there are also bras that shut from the front instead of the back. There are actually a team number of bras, but trust me, a nude and a black bra, which can also be made strapless, is literally all that you need for your outfits. Another thing that I wanted to talk to you guys about was shapewear. So if you're ever wearing something body fitting like a body conscious, these will be really helpful. They give you a really nice fitting as well. And if you're conscious of how your stomach looks, if you're wearing something body fitting, which I do sometimes, these can be really helpful. This one is from Shy Away. And this also has a little extra butt padding at the back. So it gives that extra little support to your uh, bum area as well. Last but not the least, I also recommend that you guys keep seamless panties in your collection. They have no lining and they actually look seamless whenever you wear a body fitting dress or even jeans they help you avoid that panty line that shows up if you wear those regular cotton panties which I personally don't like and uh, I'm pretty sure no one likes the panty lines when they show through your outfit so make sure you have seamless panties I have a black and a nude so that's about it that is what I want to share with you guys about lingerie I hope you guys found this video helpful and enjoyed watching it as usual, don't forget to hit that like button, that share button and also subscribe to my channel. I'll also be mentioning links to some of these lingerie from Shy Away in the description box. They are super affordable and they have great offers like buy two bras and get three free, which is great. So don't forget to check that out and I'll see you guys in my next video.